In this video, I'm going to show you how I was able to successfully register for the A2P Tim DLC within Go High Level using their internal lead connector phone system. Let's get right into it. The only thing that you need to make this entire process successful is you need a calendar link with a form that simply has the terms and conditions, essentially just the opt-in consent from the person filling it out. If you create a new calendar, it'll default with the form with the terms and conditions. Then just go to your calendar settings, come right here to the three dots and copy the permanent link. From there, navigate over to the phone numbers and go ahead and hit start now. This is the same as the trust center. From there, hit start registration. 80% of the time, you're gonna be registering a business with an EIN. You can talk to the person you're helping register and they'll tell you what they have. In most cases, you're gonna be doing low volume standard. It tells you what you're gonna get with each option. Just go ahead and discuss that with the person you're helping signing up to figure out what would be best for them. From there, you're gonna have the owner fill in all the details that they're asking for. This is not something you're gonna have access to unless you're collecting it from your client beforehand. I had everybody that I got registered fill it out themselves. It's pretty simple and easy. The biggest thing that they need is their EIN. So just make sure you have them grab their EIN before they start this process. Everything else they should know. Once you get to step six is where it starts to get a little complicated, but no worries, Go High Level actually made this super simple. So for step six, all you need to do is actually open up their examples, go ahead and copy and paste them all because you're pretty much gonna be using this number for all those if you're running an agency, a SaaS or an AA agency through this account. So just copy their examples and paste them in and you're gonna do the same thing for step seven and eight. Now, the one thing that you wanna make sure of is that when you're copying and pasting these examples, that you're actually changing out this phone number to be the number that you're registering and make sure you're changing the company name to the company that you're actually registering. And the last variable that you need to be changing here is simply where they plug in the website. So that's where the calendar link comes into play. All you're gonna do is go ahead and plug in that calendar link that we grabbed earlier into wherever they have the booking link as well. And these are the only three changes that I made to get this registration approved. Same thing for page eight, just grab their example. And again, you're just pasting that calendar link where they have that placeholder link. Again, changing the phone number and putting in the correct company name. And then once you've got all that done, just go ahead and hit submit. And within a few days, you should see that you are now a2P 10 DLC compliant. All right, that's a wrap. It really is that simple. I submitted a few of them earlier this week and I've already got my first successful registration. If you got value out of this video, like I trust that you did, go ahead and drop a like. Go ahead and join us in the SaaS MMA launch so you can get cold call scripts and everything that you need to get your first couple of bucks so that you can start running paid ads and make this super simple. You can also find my GHL affiliate link and all the perks that you get for being one of those within my Discord as well. Anyways, I'll see you in the next video.